today. I'm so excited to share with you the Motivate Blend. It comes in two forms, a 5ml and a 10ml diluted version. All right, so I'll tell you more about it. Um, but if you're like me, you're probably thinking, I am highly motivated. I really probably don't need this oil. Um, and you're right, um, most of the time I need the grounding oil, the calming oil, um, but there has been times that uh, this oil has um, really picked me up and helped me going because I feel like I'm a uh, achiever, right? I have to get going. I feel bad about myself if I, if I don't pick myself up, but sometimes it's hard to, so you need some help. All right, so this is Motivate in a nutshell. Uh, it helps with confidence. It helps you with courage. It helps motivate, of course. It helps reduce confusion and feeling overwhelmed. All right, so if you're already thinking, yeah, yeah, I, I'd get that sometimes, this might be another oil that you put in your repertoire of favorites. Okay, it helps reduce mental and physical fatigue and exhaustion. Uh, helps you with respiratory support and digestive support and emotionally it helps you with feeling uh, encouraged hopeful energized and confident all right so that's uh, another reason why you might like this so now this oil has eight is a blend of eight essential oils okay well one is absolute um, so rosemary uh, yuzu from japan and that's a citrus oil uh, melissa uh, clementine and basil, uh, vanilla, absolute, peppermint and coriander. And I'll share with you uh, what each of these oils do. Okay, so peppermint is the oil that helps um, you feel uplifted. Okay, so um, you know sometimes when you're down your heart is heavy, right? So this is the oil that helps you feel uplifted right away. So that's one of the best things that can do um, to pick you up uh, really quickly. Um, then we have clementine and yuzu. These are citrus oils. And like most citrus oils, they're happy. They're energetic. They're abundant. Okay. They say, you know what? Calm your troubles. All right. It's going to be okay. <laughs> Right, um, so you have coriander. Coriander reminds you to honor yourself and have integrity, not let other people's opinions or energy affect you. How nice is that? Okay, so if you know that you're a certain way, um, whatever other people think and feel about you is none of your business, right? And you don't need to be affected by it, but it's when we are unsure of who we are, we tend to feel like, you know what, maybe they're right and we doubt ourselves, okay? We feel discouraged. Okay, so that's why coriander's in there, it's awesome. Now we also have, let's see here, um, we have the Melissa oil, and Melissa is the oil um, of light. It helps you stand in the light and operate from that light space so that you can see things from a better perspective and see the bright side of things. Isn't that great? Okay, because nothing is beyond repair for God, right? So that's wonderful to have that. Uh, so you have also basil here and basil or basil um, is really refreshing and it helps you refresh restart and renew. So clean that slate, get a new slate, whatever it is, start over again, don't worry, don't get discouraged. Okay, what's in the past is in the past, it doesn't determine what's in the future. All right, isn't that great? All right, so rosemary is the oil of transition. So it helps you um, get out of this situation or this mindset and then switch over to another mindset. Um, so some people, you know, and I feel like sometimes this is me too, um, when you get stuck in um, a little rut and you just can't, you want to turn on that switch and try to be happy and positive, but it's hard, it's hard to when you still got this energy that you need to let out. Um, but rosemary helps you, you know, push that out quickly and transition. Take that one negative hat off and put another happy positive hat on okay just tra transitioning the mind and vanilla vanilla helps you with that sweetness it brings um, a little bit of um, sweetness to everything it helps you relax 
all right so those are the oils and that's why um, they have those oils in uh, this blend okay all right so I'm gonna go through the body um, mind and spirit with you now so with the body side of things this is the emotional aromatherapy oil so it's not meant for you to use for your body but it doesn't mean that you can't okay so you can use it in lots of ways um, so it's for energizing so if you want to put motivate a couple of drops in a veggie capsule or um, just in your water remember to drink water out of a glass or really good stainless steel um, and take it several times a day i mean peppermint and the citrus oils and the herbal oils help cleanse your gut right cleanse all the fungus out um, and the fungus is usually what is in there that that hijacks your energy so you can see if that the fungus is all out your body is able to absorb nutrients and have more energy right helps with digestion those oils are fantastic for digestion too. do the same thing take it in water or capsule and do it several times a day you can't just do it one time because the oils go into your body and it's released after four to six hours or it's digest and absorbed and metabolized so kind of like food okay so that it's store in your system um, so rub it on the bottom of your feet too if you like um, and then also it's fantastic for respiratory support so put a couple of drops in your palms or roll it into your palms and then cup it over your nose and mouth and inhale so good and then you do a little cup like this and suck it through so it can open up your airways I was at a restaurant the other day and I swallowed wrong and then I coughed and then the cough led to a mini asthma attack and I didn't have my breathe oil and I had some of these other ones and I used it and it worked anyways so that's fantastic okay so you know just think of what these oils are individually what can do um, but you know you think about being discouraged when you're discouraged you feel like <gasps> I can't breathe <laughs> you know and this oil helps you open up and breathe on the physical level too um, or I can't d digest information this is just too much for me you know well on a physical level this helps you digest so you can see it does so many good things alrighty um, mind um, so according to the emotions and essential oil book right so this is motivate the oil of encouragement okay encouraging um, it helps move out these negative energies so if you're feel, feeling wary discouraged stagnant gloomy lacking motivation unable to press forward okay you don't want to get up and get go and get started all right you there's too much activation energy to that you need to push put forth to do anything so this here helps um, you release all that and then adopt these positive emotions and the positive emotions are feeling motivated encouraged hopeful and energized cool huh okay so there's a few ways you can use a few reasons um, you know help you boost confidence and courage right if you are um, a little bit anxious about doing something starting something right just rub it into your palms and inhale it all right and tell yourself I can do this you know and slowly your brain rewires and it can look for the positive things about it and see a way that you can do this um, so it's more than mind of a matter guys if you're new to doTERRA or oils and you think oh it's in the mind you know what your body produces all these chemicals too you can actually see um, the chemicals in research okay um, we have dentists now getting patients to smell the essential oils prior to their um, consultation or their surgery okay because your brain starts producing all of this norepinephrine dopamine and happy chemicals and on a physical level the oils clear and clean out the receptors all right so the receptors can communicate again which means it can produce those happy chemicals okay so it's very very tied in together and very scientific <laughs> all right in case you don't know that um, so it helps clear confusion and overwhelm now if you wake up in the morning and you have a gloomy kind of feeling and you think I'm confused I'm overwhelmed there's too much to do today right you might have had some negative dark energy that have kind of messed with you a little bit in the evening or at night time when you're um, asleep if you've watched movies and things um, that kind of bother you watched the news and you go to bed and your brains all 
try to sort through that negativity um, and you didn't rest well so you're gonna wake up and feel that confusion so make it a habit now to reach for that motivate smell it uh, smell it and tell yourself hey it's okay I'm gonna do this I can do this all right and it'll help pick you up and get you going again Alrighty, so it's you that needs to pick it up. It's there and it will help and it will um, pick you up, but um, you need to do the, the original choice of um, changing that, okay? So the next thing here on the screen you can see is um, lift out of darkness. Um, so sometimes you feel like you have you're just stuck, right? Like what I was talking about. This is the rosemary working, right? And you really want to get out of this rut, but you keep thinking of all of those negative things. And if you spend all that creative energy on the negative side, you're going to keep creating negativity, right? You know exactly what you don't like, um, but you haven't really chosen or designed what you do like okay so this helps you kind of pick yourself up from the darkness and look over here on the positive side what do i really want to create and so maybe this is an opportunity for you to um, just design your ideal day ideal week ideal clients that you really want to work with and not those that you don't okay um, so this helps with encouraging action um, so the people who have ideas, they want to, want to have good intentions to do so much, but they just can't get started, right? You have given yourself so many excuses um, to be hedge up your way, to be in your way, um, so that it's really hard to uh, activate um, that dream, okay, or that goal that you have. So this oil, smell it. Or rub it on your tummy it's with uh, it's slightly diluted if you just get the roll on um, then it's already diluted so you're fine there um, and rub it on your tummy the tummy area the middle area is your action area it's your creative center all right so apply it there and um, get started okay take things one step at a time um, and that's what the peppermint does and that's what the basil does it helps you see things in a digestible form so that you can take things um, one thing at a time and then before you know it you're off and running okay um, the last thing here under mind is an addiction to abuse and drama all right so sometimes we can't see that in ourselves we just think oh so much is happening you know I can't stand it um, but sometimes it's because we haven't decided and chosen to have peace and to have happiness. Um, so uh, you just have to be honest with yourself. Ask yourself, you know, do, does, do I come from a family of dramas? Uh, lots of things happen all the time. Um, then sometimes you, you feel uncomfortable. It's unfamiliar to have just peace. There's nothing I need to do today. There's um, nothing to worry about today what do I do with myself right so um, one of my girlfriends she was talking about her son she actually sees herself in her son a lot um, so right now she's going through a divorce and her son he um, doesn't want to go to school he's so depressed he doesn't want to go to church necessarily anymore um, and he has all these excuses I don't like that person that person doesn't like me or whatever those are just excuses really but um, it's it's sort of like he wants to have more drama and I asked her do you know what you want you know what makes you happy um, no do you think your your son knows what makes him happy right if things are calm and quiet are you uncomfortable right so um, this oil will help you change that okay so smell this motivate oil put it in the diffuser for several days okay and design what you want and let go of that need for drama or that abuse. All right, sometimes um, I see students of mine, they've been, um, that, that's, all, that's the only way they get attention when they mess up, when they are naughty, right? So you have to try and train your own brain because you're old enough now, right, to um, get love and attention from yourself first 
and then um, you know you won't need to have that validation and love and attention from others and it'll come anyways because you have shown the world how lovable you are because you love yourself you send that energy forth okay so the last thing is the spirit okay um, this helps you realign your life um, to, with your life's purpose all right so we have this beautiful heart that kind of tells us when we're happy and we're not a lot of us um, sometimes ignore it but when you're unhappy you need to realize that you chose to be unhappy and you don't need to you chose to be with um, these people or worked with these people you've chosen it um, and the situation sometimes you've chosen it because by default if you didn't choose something good and positive you're gonna get the default right so um, as soon as you recognize your responsibility to make these choices um, you'll be liberated I promise okay so um, lately uh, I'm going through a personal development course and my husband um, is teaching and um, you know it asked me to reflect on my life's purpose and I recognize that I was letting negative people um, use and abuse me um, and hold me back from moving forward and hanging out with the people that I really want to um, so when I re recognize that I'm like oh that's why I wasn't a hundred percent happy lately so what would make me 100% happy? And so I had to see how I need to eliminate th certain things that were, you know, that's dark and, you know, holding me back. Okay, so same to you. All right, go for it. Just find it out, prune and weed out your garden, your life, and find what it is that create joy and blissfulness in, in your heart. Um, sometimes it's, never, it's not going to be blissful all the time, but at least you have... This sense of peace underlining it all that things are going to be okay even if there's a little bit of a hiccup here and there um, but most of the time things are quiet things are good okay the other thing that you can do with this oil is awaken your soul um, it's very important um, to awaken uh, yourself up a lot of us are asleep um, so I'll tell you some examples so you can see what I mean um, so as you use essential oils more you'll recognize and be more sensitive to your feelings uh, you might think I'm more emotional I'm I'm more um, you know uh, I guess um, aware of what I'm feeling and I, I'm sad I'm here and there and I, I think not necessarily um, you're just more aware of your ups and downs and this is an opportunity for you to um, master it and have, take control of it okay in the past you must might have let it go and just be whatever I'm mad I'm angry I'm you know irritated about this and that and that and um, you're really asleep so what happens when we're asleep we are in a bit of a coma, right? Things will happen around us that we're unaware. And that's with most people. They're unaware of what's happening around them. They're unaware of the colors of, um, you know, the, the, the grass, the flowers, the little things around them. They think they are, but they're really not. Um, but as you are more aware, your switches are on and clearer and your eyes are open and you feel and sense people you feel and sense food more so certain foods will actually irritate you more um, it's not what's wrong about you it's what's right about you okay so you're no longer asleep um, the good thing is you will sense more joy all right you sense your darkness and stuff but you will sense more joy and you'll be able to choose more joy okay and create more purposefully all right so there's really really good reasons for you to be awakened all right everyone should be awakened all right um, and so this oil will help you with that and uh, what I want to share with you is this beautiful affirmation um, so you can say I can create my happiness so as you use that motivate oil in your diffuser whenever you pick up the motivate oil you can make that association and rewire your brain and think I can be happy I can create happy okay so when something is not going right makes you unhappy um, you think oh why did I choose that why did I allow that Ooh. Um, and then choose again 
all right re renew um, and refresh and start afresh you see what I mean that's why these oils in here are in here for a reason okay so no matter what's happening in your life you can still choose to be happy you can be unattached to things uh, outcomes and you know we can just always review and reflect um, and have that you know motivation again to live life to the fullest alrighty so I'm grateful that you've been here and uh, um, watch this video with me um, of me <laughs> um, so I hope that you enjoy uh, this um, oil for more information go to jadebolden.com forward slash motivate and um, if you don't have a doTERRA account please contact me or the person who sent you this video and we'll hook you up with a wholesale account where you can buy your oils for 25% off and more um, if you would like to do some energy healing with me um, because you lack this motivation or whatever, go ahead and go to my website jadebolden.com and um, just book a time with me and we'll have a chat. If you want to do this doTERRA business with me, I do have um, a section on my website um, where you can apply to interview with me um, and we can see what we can do for you, okay? Um, but uh, until then, I'm sending you lots of love, light and healing. Take care. Bye for now.